Hey, this is Anne coming from ChristianOwned.com. Check us out in the Save Money section. Just want to show you what I did today at CVS and Rite Aid. The items you see on the table are from CVS, the tie and the VO5 and the red vines. I decided to do some stocking up. All these items, with the exception of the two VO5s, two of those I, my daughter got for me for free um, this week as well. But it would have cost $20. Five dollars and eighty-six cents. I pay four dollars and eighty-six cents. I'm gonna show you what I did with coupons that I used. The tie was on sale for five dollars and ninety-seven cents. I got four of those. I rung up at twenty-three dollars and eighty-eight cents. And the VO5 that was ninety-nine cent each. The red vine was two dollars and twenty-seven cents. So the coupons that I used, I had a two-dollar off any shampoo. I got that from the red box at CVS where you take your card and scan and it prints out coupons. I was doing that um, a week ago. I was getting those $2 coupons just about every day. So I used that. I had a, also from the red box a $3 off Tide if I purchased at least $10 or more. I have four $1 coupons on any Tide product. And that came from the Sunday paper this past Sunday, the P&G. And then I had $4 off 20. If I spend at least $20, I get $4 off. And I am signed up with um, CVS, so they send me emails. And this is one of the ones I got and had the option of either printing it out or adding it to my card. And I added it to my card. And then I came in with $8 in extra care bucks that I had from a previous transaction a week ago. So using those coupons, those total, all those coupons total up to $21. And that's how I paid $4.86. The red vine, that actually came from a Facebook promotion that CVS was doing. They gave you an option to pick three different ones. I decided to pick the $2 off. I think they're celebrating so many years, I guess, of something. I can't remember the exact thing for it. But you can just go to Facebook um, on their Facebook page, click it, and then you get, I, I picked a $2 off candy. So that candy was $2.27. I paid $0.27. Cent. Now let's roll over to Rite Aid. I actually did three separate transactions. I came in with $6 in up rewards from another trans transaction. So the Crest, that was on sale for $4.99. So I got two of those. I had used two $0.75 cent off coupons. So that dropped the price down to $8.48. And then I paid with my $6 up reward. So the price was $2.48 that I pay out of pocket. And I received two $3 up rewards because it was $3 up per item. The next transaction, I bought the two scopes and the Don. The scope was on sale at $2.99. Don was $0.95. Cent. I didn't have any coupons for the scope, but the Don, I had a $0.25 cent coupon. So the total for both of those items together was $6.68. So I used the $6 I just got back from the first transaction. And that made that total out of pocket $0.68 cent plus tax. And then from that transaction, I got back $4 in up rewards. So I took that $4 and used it to pay for my last transaction. I got the Don again, and I had three more 25 cent coupons that I used. So it was 95 cent um, times three, that was 285 minus the 75 cent in the coupons, that came to 210. So since I have $4 in up rewards, I added the gum to get it up to four because I can't use the up reward unless either the exact price or above. So the stride was. 69 cent each for four, it was 278. That brought my total to four dollars and 86 cent minus the four dollars in ups. I pay 86 cent plus tax. So, my total that I pay for these three items, these three transactions, total out of pocket 
was four dollars and two cents. So those are my transactions and happy couponing.